welcome to my channel and thank you for joining me for Yoga to the Songs, Songs 2. Remember, these are isometric holds. We're going to start with a heart the heart over here, bend your knees a little bit, against the Lord. bring your arms up behind you, Let us break their and point your heart to the ceiling. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh, the Lord shall have them in derision. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath, and vex them in sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy now hill. Now we're going to do an Andal Andalai Mudra. I will declare the decree. We just kind of do a prayer pose. Sink down into your this day legs and into a chair. Ask of me, and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance, and the uttermost parts of the earth for thy possession. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Now, Sir, we are going to go into a salutation truth. seal. Kiss the so you straighten your legs, and you but unlike a forward fold, you will keep your back flat, and you do so lower down to the ground. Psalm you can use tripod if you need to. Why the heathen Blocks. And the people imagine a vain thing. Or you can come down to hands The kings flat. of the earth set themselves. And the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree the Lord hath said unto me, now, if you hate Thou art my son. Turn this your day hands. Over Ask of me, and I shall give thee the kingdom for thine inheritance, and the uttermost parts of the earth. Just to allow position. your wrists. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash wrists. them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Okay. Serve the now, Lord the and we're going to go into Kiss the Hades, sun, lest be angry, or also and known as bear pose. Lay down. Wrath is but don't let Listen, your knees touch the floor yet. And, and just hold with your so weight on your hands and your toes. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? The kings of the earth set themselves, and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath, and vex them in sore displeasure. Okay, now we're going to alternate. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. So I will down. declare the decree. The Lord hath said unto me, Thou art my son. This day have I begotten thee. Just do it nice. Ask of me, and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance, and the uttermost parts of the earth for thy possession. You're going to really feel this Thou in shalt your legs. break them with a rod of iron. That's okay. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with fear. Okay, now we're going to hold up on our toes again. Kiss the sun, lest he be angry, and Just he perish from the way, it. when his wrath is kindled but a little. Blessed are all they that put their trust in him. Good. Now, Why do the heathen we're going to go into a moon. Salutation. The kings of the earth say Moon salutation. Very similar against the to downward dog. Saying, Just bring your let us break their bands of sun and cast away their cords. Stretch. Even and bring this the head up. Shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Now we're just gonna hold. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath, and vex them in sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree. The Lord hath said unto now. me. Thou art my son. Bring this day have I begun. Raise leg. Ask of me up I shall give thee the heathen. Between your toes. Come up. And stretch. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. And that's moon salutation. Now, therefore, o ye kings. The if it hurts to bend your back, just do so straight like with this. Fear, and rejoice with trembling. Okay. The sun, lest he be angry. Now we're going to go back down. down. With his wrath is kindled, but a little. Back into our moon salutation. Step day. 
Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine their villains? Stretch. Stretch. The kings of the earth set themselves, and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in his sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree. The Lord hath said unto me, Thou art my son. This day have I begotten. Ask of me, and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance, and the uttermost parts of the earth for thy possession. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise, ye poor, O ye Gentiles. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with fear yeah, and rejoice with trembling. Kiss the sun, lest I be angry and you perish from the way. When his wrath is drained open on the floor, that lets him flatten your upper body and really can to the floor. Psalm 2. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? The kings of the earth set themselves, and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. No. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in his sore displeasure. Yes, hold your plank. Yet have I sent my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree. The Lord hath said unto me, Thou art my son. This day have I begotten thee. Ask of me, and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance, and, then we're gonna and the uttermost parts of the earth those. for thy possession. So you know, thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings. Be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with fear.